Uh, hi. It's when Wednesday. A little ahead of myself. It's uh Monday. Hi. We're uh continuing with the GeoGuessr thing with our normal Monday thing. We're doing another US state, which happens to be Connecticut. Um and here we are. We went from Colorado, which was that giant state here to a very tiny, tiny state. Good old Connecticut. Capital Hartford. And that's all I know about Connecticut. Um, I haven't been there much. It just feels like it's, a, to me, the un... Um, I hate this logo, the slogan. The uneducated person that I am. This feels like it's just a suburb of if it's not New York, it'll be a suburb of Providence. Which is, excuse me, it's not fair, but what are you going to do? I have to try to find Bloom, Bloomfield now. Um, I did do, I think this, this either this state or, this state at least, maybe not the map, back when I was, uh, oh, no, they don't say the next town next to it, um, back when I went on vacation. So, um, I don't remember much other than it just felt like it was a big giant friggin', um, excuse me a sec, sorry. It was just a big, uh, like this. Blue Hill Station. I don't know where Bloomfield is. This feels like it's a town near a very large one. Um, I think I'm going the wrong way because I'm trying to find, um, like, the road out of town to Mount Sinai Hospital, huh? Well, I don't know where Mount Sinai is. Are we outside Hartford? Like, I've heard of Sinai, but I don't even think this is the same Mount Sinai, but to rehab St. Francis Hospital. Oh, man. Like, it, this is going to happen a lot when I'm looking at this stuff of like, oh, I've heard these words before said so many times, and it's just, I'm never going to be able to remember and or locate where this is. I'm just going to end up making educated guesses saying that this looks like a big, like that, not suburban, but it's in between being in the city and the suburbs, whatever that city burb is. Is that Creole? Oh shit. Apparently there's enough of a uh, Creole population. I did see a bus and I'm gonna hopefully go back and uh, have it come into vision here, but I'm just gonna guess that we're, I'm gonna look around some of the larger towns here, the ones that I know, and see if any of them say Bloomfield around it, or uh, Mount Sinai. Alright, so it's not that one. Let's try Hartford. Not seeing it. Um, Going to here. Not seeing it. New Britain? No. Nope. I feel like it would be a big enough thing that you would definitely see. This is New London. Nope. Alright, well, I did check New Haven, didn't I? Alright, five seconds. I'm just gonna hedge bet put us there. We're near one of these big cities. I'm just leaving it. Yeah, okay. And how far did I have to go in to see Cyanide? Or am I just completely um what I'm probably doing is just assuming that these are the two same things, and it probably isn't. But tiny, tiny state, the uh, margin for error is going to be atrocious as far as me actually being able to figure out where we are. That is the Connecticut plate. It's a gradient from like a bright blue to white. Let me take a drink. With some dark blue on it. Um cool little fog here. This place is pretty indicative about the rest of 
New England. Maybe not as much mountains. I don't know how mountainous um, Connecticut gets, but I just feel that anybody who works out in New York will just commute from, if it's not Jersey, they'll do it from Connecticut. But I don't know. I'm not rich or live in Connecticut or New York to know that for sure. Uh, one of my friends, uh, one of their siblings, at least at the time, I don't know if they still are, lived in Connecticut near a casino. I think it was Mohegan's Sun. I don't remember exactly where it is. I think it was on the waterfront, mainly because she was an engineer for some... Oh, we're in Kent, huh? Well, I should have known that. They were, they were some engineer for a nuclear sub uh, manufactory, and I went to one of their christenings of some nuclear sub they just finished building. I forget what it was called, but it was a weird thing to watch. Just having, like, zero idea. Bulls Bridge. Okay, I thought this was maybe, like, a flood thing, and it would kind of let me know, hey, maybe we're near the ocean, but I don't think so. Bulls Bridge. Hmm. Come back here. I kind of skipped ahead a smidge. <clears throat> see what this says. Broughton. Oh, I can't make that out. Gas is... That's really expensive. Um, uh, can I see the actual, like, 2019 is the copyright on this, but I don't know if this is when... I doubt this is when the actual uh, picture was taken, because... I'm a state, two, two states away, and gas is uh, 50 to 60 cents cheaper a gallon. Now, I know like places in Europe, it's more expensive because you do it by the liter, but it's still a lot. What do we got here? Covered bridge into Kent. Ah, uh, yes, the big deal about covered bridges, and they have this thing up here letting you know the actual height of the bridge so you don't be that fucking idiot and... uh wreck the uh, very historic covered bridge. They're a big deal up here. Covered bridges. I mean, all it is is just a very old wood bridge. And uh, we can't go that way. It's probably for the best. There are plenty of them around where I live as well. And every now and then you're going to hear one of two ish like news reports about it. Either they've uh, flooding caused structural damage or an idiot in a very tall truck caused structural damage and they had to shut it down for repairs. Driving on them, you're like, oh, it's cool, but I can't help the fact that every time I go over in a car, I feel like, oh, this is when it's going to shatter. For some reason, like that much wood holding up a moving vehicle just seems completely impossible to me. I've seen nothing to let me have an idea as to where we are here. I'm going to see if I can't see Kent just, like, show up in uh, a quick scan by. Oh, shit. Um, there. And I, oh, there was Kent. Okay. I could have seen it if I hadn't had zoomed in here and had my eyes already in this direction heading that way. I might have actually been able to see it. I'm going to do really bad on this one, I'm pretty sure. Brother Bones is a great name for a uh, business. This looks very much just like where we were um, round one. Hmm. Oh, Hartford. So I feel we're in Hartford. Exactly where? I don't know. Unless it's Franklin Ave. Doesn't help me. This seems so weird. Like... These are the type of buildings you see very closely put together in the middle of a city, but it's like they had the idea for it to be there, and then no one else followed suit to build uh, build buildings around it. Franklin Ave. is like, I don't think that's a very... Well, maybe it is. I mean, I don't know anything about Hartford. Maybe Franklin Ave's a very well-known road. There's Franklin Ave. Okay. All right, so now I got to look for Hartford's Pizza. That very well could be it. Let me hit home. Uh, Hartford Pizza was a little ahead. 
yeah, it's a weird rectangle. I think I've just 100% nailed this. Uh, fadeaway barbershop down here. We got Franklin Motor. Yeah, right there. Well, I found it very easily. Fadeaway barbershop. Sandwich on. Hmm. One thing I do not miss about um Cell Loco. That's hilarious. Um not having hair is having to do barbershop stuff. I mean it feels weird. Like I, I don't understand the whole uh sorry I need a drink again. Hmm. Like I don't completely understand the like dialogue you're supposed to have when you're getting a haircut. I'm just kind of like, just cut my hair. I'd, I mean, if you'll talk to me, I'm not going to be like stonewalling you, but I'm not the one who's going to initiate conversation because uh, it's... I'm just like, hey, you know, I'll just cut my hair. You don't have to talk to me because when I'm not sitting there actually making any conversation, then maybe they feel like, oh, maybe I have to force the convo. And... Excuse me. And then me being nice will help him talk. I'll, I'll talk back to him just because I'm not going to be like, no, I don't want to talk. What is this? Fraternity? I, it, I know it's... Mm, man. Seltzer in the morning is a bad idea. I should just be a normal person and have coffee or something, but... Alpha, Iota, Omega? Now, I don't know why seeing it spelled with an L, uh, an F, Makes me feel weird because you know phonetically it makes sense that it should be Alpha with a F and Alpha Romeo, the car company. I'm pretty sure is spelled with an F too. Why is it striking me weird now? Maybe because I'm in the thought process of it having to be the Greek alphabet, and this is a fraternity. But I don't know many t fraternities with bars in the door, <laughs> and I want to see if I can get around the side here and just look at this. This. Definitely looks nothing like a fraternity. I wonder what it is. Is it actually showing up on the on the map here? This would be it, but nothing's showing up. Hmm. Oh fuck you for not giving me five more points. That's a little bullshit. That's a smidge, just a just the smallest. Pettiest bullshit. Because you saw how well I, 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 I got that. I was so confident that love is louder than chicken. What a weird sentence. Is this a house? I mean, it, I think people live there. They got a grill on the porch there. That looks horribly uh, fired ha fire hazardy. Interstate Lakeland and Lumber is open to the public. I don't trust and or believe you. This looks like a very hot day. This feels like summer. Too hot. Just be an oof. Um, I don't know if we can get any more rural in this state than this. Let's see what we got at this house. Is this that one house that's got just clutter everywhere? Have vines growing and everything. Fence up. Oh, we're doing this again. Apparently we're going skyward, even though we're going forward. Let's... This is going to take me way too long to actually, like, get far enough down the road to maybe see an intersection or something. Nothing's distinguished itself. Property works of... Can't make it out. This house has not been uh, kept up in a very long time. Oh, it's property works of Connecticut. Doesn't help me. I don't think anybody's lived here for a very long time. Look at all that paint. This gets so much sun exposure that it's just warping the paint off. No one's mowed this yard. That's going to take so much to clean up. Oh, we do have... Can I get one more? No, of course not. Why would I? That's saying where we are, I have a very good feeling of it. The only problem is, probably, 
never going to get close enough to actually see it. It looks like a rooster. Can I get in this road? No, Botsford. Uh, I just got to hope to get across another road turning the other way. Come on. Okay, we have an intersection here. Let's get back to this corner here. And of course, one forward, too far. I cannot make that out. Hmm. Let's go right here. Get a burrito shack. That doesn't help me. Masonic care. Oh, we've got a square dance. Oh, man. It's something there. Believe me, you don't want to learn how to square dance. It's awful. I, I dislike square dancing immensely. It is not what I find entertaining in any way. I got nothing. I'm going to get a shitty score on this one again, just because it's nondescript. I got Northford. Botsford. What the fuck's Botsford? Look in this corner again. I'm going to click here just so I don't forget. But Botsford is not going to show up on my... Like, to my eyes. This is a too small of a town for it to... I'm just assuming this is the most rural part. Would be up in this corner. Yeah, I've... Look, I, how far do I gotta go in here? Oh, yep, very far. Look at how shitty this score is. This is embarrassing. But I knew that coming into... Coming into this one. <clears throat> what happened to my voice there? I don't know, but... Okay, this is... In a large city. What do we got? Dr. Joe Renzulli? Gifted and talented academy. Ugh, I just reading that is making me bored. <laughs> um, like maybe this is Hartford again, just because that looks like a building that big city's gonna have. Let's get towards an intersection and maybe this seems to be the lawyer section of town. <laughs> Let's see what do we got. Speed limits. Webs yeah, we're in Hartford. Okay, so... Once again... This is going to be very hard to find where we are. I mean, we're near a downtown, and the downtown has... Yeah, those... Big buildings that just stick up. Like, maybe that's the XL Center. And we're actually, like this part somewhere here I'm going to click like uh, here and then maybe kind of roam around until I find a uh, larger like road or intersection interesting that this is two lanes no that's just parking never mind alright we do have intersection what do we have here that's a big okay Buckingham Street and what Main Street, okay. Look for Main Street. That's Main Street, okay. Apparently it turns into Maple, that's not good. Look for a Buckingham, <clears throat> excuse me. It's happening in my voice, I don't know. Oh, there's a Main Street. Buckingham. Maybe we're over here? Did Main Street disappear? Well, Main Street turns into this. Okay, so this is a large road. And... Charter Oak Street? Okay, it's it's gone away from Main Street again. Alright, so I've got a minute to look for Charter Oak. Burnside. Was this a Burnside? Oh, it's Buckingham. 
Main Street, that's just 84. Pitkin Street, no. 502. Buckingham. Come on. Show yourself. And I am going very far. Not seeing it. Okay, we're like very much outside the town here. Wait, East Hartford then? Or is there another Main Street? Hmm. Um, I'm going to say we're here just to make the guess, and I'm going to make the guess. Oh. Maybe that's why I didn't see it. Where's Buckingham? Is it the other way? No. Oh well. Not a bad score, but very bad overall. Okay. Well, that's going to do it for a uh, Monday. I'm stretching. I'm awake. I seriously am. Um, but you know the deal. I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you yourself have a map you'd like me to try or any other game you'd like to have me take a look at go ahead and put them in the comments below i do read them and get back to you as soon as i possibly can um excuse me i am very much going to continue with uh battle tech at least for this week um give it a gander if you could so please if it interests you if it doesn't that's fine too but at least We'll always have GeoGuessr, at least for the time being. And I'll have to come back again on uh, next Monday for whatever fuck stays next. Is that Delaware? I think so. Anyway, thank you all for watching. We will see you next time. Goodbye.